Hey, weirdos. Uh, wanted to give you a real quick update as to what's going on with, uh, you know, considering the, the post that I put up on Facebook yesterday. For those of you who don't follow me on Facebook, uh, you probably have no idea what I'm referring to. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in the podcast and also on YouTube as well. So everybody's kind of up to speed. Uh, you, you probably have noticed that uh, I haven't been posting uh, as consistently as I, as I normally do. And uh, that's because, um, well, that's because I ran out of meds uh, about a week and a half ago, and you're gonna hear a lot of ums and uhs uh, in this video because I'm having a hard time concentrating right now, which is part of the reason that you're that time having a hard time posting on a regular basis. Uh, I ran out of meds for both my depression and also for my headache and vertigo uh, about a week and a half ago. And it turns out there was a glitch, either a glitch in the system or a human error. Something happened where the drugstore thought they had filled the prescription and sent it to me. And according to their records, they have, but I've never received it. And they had two different numbers. And maybe the two numbers canceled each other out. Uh, the numbers on the prescriptions, that is. I, I don't know exactly what happened. They don't either, but they're making good on it right now. Um, but if you have depression and you're on depression meds, you know you do not stop cold turkey. Uh, with meds. That's, people do some crazy things when they stop cold turkey if they're on depression meds, especially if those meds are strong like mine. Uh, I mean, people have harmed themselves, others, committed suicide. I am not to that level, so don't you don't have to worry about that. I don't have those kind of dark thoughts. The, the darkest thought that I've had the last week and a half is I came this close to quitting my job. Uh, just, but that was the depression talking. That wasn't me talking. And I, fortunately I stopped myself. I knew better. I realized I love my job. I love who I work for. Why would I do this? It makes no sense. And that's what it clicked on me. It's like, oh yeah, I'm not thinking straight right now. Uh, so by the way, if, uh, if you work for, uh, for my employer and you know who they are, uh, if you hear that I have quit my job via email, uh, don't, don't believe that. Uh, somebody, somebody tell the boss, he doesn't really mean that. If I'm, if I'm quitting my job, I'm calling you. Okay. Out of respect. I'm not going to email you to say, you know, to say that I'm, I'm gone. That's, that's not going to happen. I love my employer. I've been there now for about, uh, well, actually I think, I think this March will be eight years that I've been there, which is the longest I've ever been with any, any employer. Um, just, it's, it's a great company. Salem media group, by the way, if you want to look them up online, they, uh, they do, they're phenomenal. If, in fact, I, I want to make sure to to thank them uh, today because what I did today, I, like I said, I, I just can't concentrate for more than than a few minutes at a time right now. So I did contact them and say, hey, look, you know, here's the situation. They already knew that I had some issues. Uh, I'd already talked to them about it before. Uh, they know they know why I'm on meds and stuff. So it didn't come as a, as a complete surprise that something happened, but I was surprised that they jumped so quickly to help. Um, I said, Hey, here's the situation. I'm having a hard time concentrating. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do my job, uh, without, without screwing it up. Uh, so is it possible to take, you know, I know, I know it's last second, but is it possible to take vacation for the rest of this week or sick time or something within five minutes they got back to me and said, don't worry about it. You're covered to consider yourself a vacation. In fact, if you need next week off, we already have a backup plan in place in case that happens. Cause you know, we know this is an issue for you. We want to make sure you're taken care of. I love my job. Never have I worked for a job that, that would be that understanding. Uh, so thank you very much to Salem, Salem Corporate, Salem Chicago. You guys are, are awesome. Um, my, my goal is to never quit. Uh, so that being said, though, um, if, if you follow me on Facebook, you saw the post um, yesterday. If uh, you don't follow me on Facebook, that's why I'm here. So, so my YouTube uh, fans and my podcast fans uh, will... Uh, will understand why why I haven't been posting the way I normally do. I haven't been so consistent with it. So, like I said, I, I um, ran out of meds about a about a week and a half ago, and so that's just screwing up my thinking. Uh, I did get the meds for my vertigo and headaches uh, today. That they came in the mail, and uh, it'll take a couple of days for those to start working again. It took a while for it for it to really start taking effect when I first started taking them. Uh, and then supposedly the, uh, the depression meds are already in the mail. They're overnighting them. I should get them tomorrow. But again, just like with any meds, it takes a while for them, excuse me, uh, for meds to start kicking in. 
and doing what they're supposed to do. So, so for the next few days, I might be very sporadic in what I post. If you see that I'm posting archive episodes, that's why. Um, I just, I just, like I said, I just can't concentrate long enough to, to put together an episode. So I don't want to leave you guys, you know, hanging, wondering what's going on. So that's why I'm sending you this message and then also posting the, uh, the archive episodes throughout the rest of the week, uh, assuming I can even concentrate long enough to get those done. But I really enjoy what I do. So even though I've, I've been given permission by um, probably over 100 of you already from just the comments in the, in, uh, on Facebook saying, hey, you know, take care of yourself, don't worry about it, we love you, just, you know, just come back whenever you feel like it, just get better is the most important thing. Um, I still feel better when I do post something. It's sort of that, even even if it's an archive episode, this is a tiny little feeling of accomplishment, which I could use right now. So I'm going to go ahead and continue trying to post those. Daily Dose of Weird News, though, forget it. Um, there, um, there's no way I'm going to be able to concentrate to even write that material. It's, it's a lot harder to write for Daily Dose of Weird News because I'm thinking up punchlines and, you know, I have to be in the right frame of mind for those. And that's not going to happen this week. So I'll skip this week and maybe return to it next week. We'll see what happens. So anyway, thank you very much, though, for all of the really kind comments that people have left. If you want to uh, follow me on Facebook, uh, I've got links in the show notes so that you can follow me on the various places and kind of keep an update as to what's going on in my life. Things that you don't hear about in the podcast or on YouTube. Uh, because it's just so so easy for me just to type out a quick little blurb and send it out and not have to worry about production and audio and volume and all that other stuff. So anyway, thanks a lot. I really appreciate the comments, the prayers that you guys have been sending me uh, since this happened. Um, that's very, very appreciated. And uh, I, I uh, you, gave, you guys give me a reason to get up in the morning. And I do appreciate that. And I think that's the only thing that's going to keep me going this week. If I didn't have uh weird darkness and everything else i don't know if i'd even you know get out of bed because there, there really wouldn't be any reason to so thank you very much for giving me giving me a reason to get out of bed and actually accomplish something it actually does help me uh it's 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 less it's it's still pressure but it's a good pressure so Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. St keep weird, and uh, uh, hopefully you'll see some archive episodes coming, coming from me here very, very soon. God bless.